name is Eileen. I'm in grade 12 and I'm one of the co-leads of the announcements team. So when and what made you want to join the announcements team? I joined the announcements team at the beginning of grade 11 and I think at the time I felt like there weren't too many opportunities available at school just because we were just getting out of COVID. So yeah, I really wanted to kind of get involved, meet some new people. To me, it was kind of also a way to stay up to date with what was happening around our school. So what's the process behind getting all the announcements to be announced in the morning? Right. So we set up every year, we have a Google form that we set up and it's up to the teacher supervisors of each club to submit any announcements that they need to be read in the morning and then we just go off of the Google sheet and then we just read it. <laughs> Do you have any go-to songs or artists when choosing the music to play in the morning? Yes, I have recently like really entered my Taylor Swift era. So whenever I can, I play Taylor Swift in the morning, try to go with something that's more upbeat so that people can get energized in the morning. Ooh, I hear it. And what is one of the most memorable announcement experiences you've had? At the beginning of the year, when DECA first started doing the promotions, they have like their iconic slogan that's like DECA, DECA, DECA. And like that's just something I associate with my team. Oh, once the entrepreneurship club wanted us to sing, we did that. And recently we had a music department announcement that was also pretty interesting. It involved some dialogue. So do you enjoy singing on the announcements or would you rather not? <laughs> I would rather not, but it's part of the job and I guess we just go with whatever's thrown at us. Thank you for your time. Thank you for having me. Yeah. Say goodbye to the Roar TV watchers. Bye. 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 <laughs>